everybody and welcome to the Linux guy. Today is going to be a real short video. I just want to talk about library and Odyssey for just a minute. Now I know that some of you follow me over there and awesome. I'm glad to see you guys over on Odyssey and library. For those of you who are on BitChute or on YouTube though, uh, this video is probably for you and maybe you people over on Odyssey don't know about this plugin, but you probably have heard of it if you're over there, but maybe you haven't. So I'm posting this here too. I wanted to talk about switching over to it and how that can be daunting. I know like you don't want to go find all the people that you've subscribed to on YouTube and try to find them on library slash Odyssey and it's kind of a pain. Well, I found that this actually can be made really easy by this plugin made by Mediator 2011 called Watch on Library. Now you can get it in, I believe the Chrome store. Uh, it's available for Brave. You can get it on Firefox, which is what I'm going to demonstrate. And you just go ahead and add it like any other plugin. And once it's there, you've got this little box up in the corner. And it'll start working right away. If you find a YouTube video that's available, it will just take you straight to their channel. Now, one thing that's really cool about this is you click Enable Redirection, it does it automatically. But it also lets you choose where. So if you have the app installed on your computer for a library, you can click the app and it'll go there. Or I usually like to go to Odyssey, so I have it clicked to Odyssey. The other thing that I want to point out that I think is probably underutilized is this subscription tool. So it gives you instructions to go to takeout.google.com, and this will take a little while to do. It, it Filling out the form takes a minute, but you have to wait for it. So depending on how much stuff you have, it can take 10, 15, 20 minutes. It can even take up to a couple days if you have tons of things in Google. Uh, but I did mine not all that long ago, and it took a couple hours, just, just so I could try, try to relay to you guys what it took. Um, and basically, you follow these instructions. They're pretty straightforward. There's not much to it. You go and find this JSON file. It's in your YouTube, YouTube or YouTube Music subscriptions and subscriptions.json. If you find this file, you can browse for it on your computer here. And once you have it, you can start the conversion. It'll give you a link to all of the stuff that's on Odyssey slash library that you're already subscribed to on YouTube. So you don't have to go find it. You can just go do them real quick and get them all added. So this plugin is really powerful, even though it's so simple. And I use it all the time. The nice thing about having it too is something you like isn't over there right now, but it, it will be in the future. By using this, when it's there, it'll just go ahead and redirect you. All right, that's it for this episode. I just wanted to bring that plug into people's attention because bringing people to a decentralized platform like Odyssey and Library is something that I want this channel to push towards. So it's it's it means a lot to me to try to get people to try these new things out and get off of the big tech stuff that's just. I mean, any of you who are alive in the 2000s remember what YouTube was like then and what it is like now. They're night and day. Well, Odyssey and Library are a lot like YouTube was back in the day. So for those of you who haven't checked it out, please go check it out. And for those of you who haven't tried this plugin, you may want to look at it. As always, thank you for watching The Linux Guy, and we will see you in the next one.